Hey guys, Shinmaster X here, and today I'm going to show you how to delete your bad drivers. One reason you might want to do this is because maybe you have a lot of old drivers on your computer and you keep getting a blue screen of death and it pertains to a bad driver. So, you know, I'm going to show you right now how to delete them. Now, first what you want to do is open up command prompt. But when before you open up command prompt, you gotta right click it as administrator. So you go menu, you go down to accessories, go to command prompt and right click it and run it as administrator. Now when it opens, make sure you open it as administrator or else this is not gonna work. So what you do, you wanna type this in exactly as you see it. But I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have it in the description, so you can just copy and paste it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Hold on one second. This you want to type this in exactly as you see it, right? So you open up you open up command prompt. You type it in. I'm going to just copy and paste it. Copy. Paste. And hit enter. When you hit enter, nothing's going to happen. It's just going to go to the next line. Nothing's really going to happen. That means you did it right. So then, when you do that, you open up device manager by typing in D E V M G M T dot M S C and hit enter and then that's gonna open now once this is open here's the longest part of this process you have to open up everything here and look for grayed out um, items that's on here so for instance let me see where is it I know I got a few of them here oh you gotta go and view and t and click on show hidden devices so then everything all your bad drivers should show you see these they're grayed out you want to delete these <clears throat> but make sure before you delete them that it's something you don't recognize because if you recognize it don't delete it this can be time consuming because you gotta do it all one by one <clears throat> so once you have them all done and you have everything deleted restart your computer and you might even notice a speed difference Thanks for watching. So, if you got any other questions, just leave me a qu um a comment and I'm going to be posting up some more videos on how to do like various things with your computer. So, um yeah, just comment and subscribe and I'm going to be posting up some more videos later.